In today's video, you will see how to trim extremely curved toenails, learn why I don't use toenail clippers, and see a thorough toenail cleaning to reveal the deep indentations the pressure was causing on a caregiver for impaired adults who drove three hours to see me. So stay tuned. You know, we're getting our own hotel right down the street. Cause I like, thought it was just Hotels.com not updating the area because I definitely look for something right here. Nothing. No. Even the yeah. Saline Inn, Saline Inn was, is an eater, it's a food place. Yes, 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 it's a cafe. <laughs> If you're new here, welcome. Please subscribe and turn on your notifications in case you are chosen as the winner in the random comment game. I figured that's the one thing that I could do for myself. That's right. So I'm the truck driver. So you could have stopped anywhere when you were doing I was that. Never huh? this close though. Oh. That was that was so weird. I hardly ever was in this area. When toenails are beginning to turn into pincer nails, they get this extreme curve to them and you can't trim them straight across. You have to cut up on one side and up on the other. And sometimes you have to make one more little cut across the time top, but oftentimes it just um, cracks over and it comes right off. Yeah. Then I film. You're just right down the street. That's nothing. Man, it's like you're going all the way to Michigan. I'm like, quit saying all the way. Right. It's right next door. Yeah, probably three hours it took you. It was exactly for right under three hours to the hotel. I mean, even here, I like, it's only like six, 15 minutes away at that. <laughs> What's your favorite thing from Tim Hortons? I like the the croissant, but they mess mine. I don't eat eggs, and they put eggs and cheese on it. Oh. And I'm funny about what cheese goes on certain meats. Right. Cheese does not belong on everything. Right. Because I actually love cheese. But that's going to tear me up because I just recently stopped eating for every. Oh, really? I found some really good flavorful chicken and turkey sausage. They've come a long way. Oh. And I used to couldn't eat turkey. Oh, my God. That just felt good right there. <laughs> Jesus. Um, just getting rid of that pressure. Yes. But I can really tell it isn't always easy to determine how much length to remove from someone's toenails, so it's important to always clean out from underneath the toenail with your ingrown toenail cleaner or the toenail rasp so you can determine how much more length it is safe to take off without cutting their hypernicium. And you're going to see what causes the pressure and the pain on the sides of toenails when it's a lot of impacted material down in those sidewalls and underneath the toenail. I gotta be better. I'm a terrible eater. Stop, you are a toothpick. You are thin. I just gained Excellent. 10 pounds. And you're still, and you still look good, girl, so you know. <laughs> I'm still a terrible eater. I don't want to die because I have a clogged heart or something. <laughs> yeah, but then you also have to think of what, the, what they're putting in the food, though. Yeah. You know, I wish. You know, I tried ordering these, um, oh, they were these frozen fruits and vegetables that you blend up into a smoothie. I've seen it. It almost looks like it's in, it's like, like, in a, a cardboard. Yes. Yeah. Is that yeah, it was delicious. It's just the time. Like, I didn't eat them fast enough, and you have to order them so many per month, and mm. finally, I had a whole freezer full of them that I hadn't eaten yet, and I'm 
like, ugh, because the girls would be like, who wants Wendy's? I'm like, me. <laughs> so <laughs> we'd be eating bad again. But I work in an actual home, so I get to cook more of my meals. So when I was on the truck, I ate more. Yeah. How old is your son? Oh no, I work in a group home oh, that has mentally oh, and physically disabled oh, people. That's awesome. I never had that mom. No. It's exhausting, yeah. I I don't know. I, yeah, so I feel like I do have kids now, and they are one me when I come in the house, like, all four of them. They depend on you. Yeah, I like them, they're sweet. I like your like cousins. They think they're little cousins, well not little, they're all older than me. They are like kids, they are childlike. Mm-hmm. Mentally, we work twelve hour shifts. Right. Oh my that, gosh. Yes, yes. And when I worked that shift on a regular, I was working twice a day. I'm like, I'm too old. You know, I don't like to use the old word. <laughs> I'm too old for that. Right. That's some old young girl shift. I mean, when you right. think that's twice a day. I'm getting off at 9 o'clock in the morning. Have to go home, do whatever I have to do, then go to sleep. And then I have to be back up to work at 9 o'clock at night. Yeah. That's no joke. That's a long day. It, it was no joke. I didn't even know they had it in theaters. Well, well you know, they you maybe remember Trotwood, Ohio? Trotwood, like right outside of Dayton? Okay. They had their own little theater. Oh. And like a little strip mall, like over here, but if they was playing that, and it was really, you know, it's a small operation, but it's, it's nice. Good. Not as fine as it is. It's like, you know, it's like, like I cleaned the room and I probably left it in better shape than I got it. It's funny. gonna feel really good because you do have a lot of people don't realize how much skin builds up around in their sidewalls. Causes all that pressure. That I started watching you. And they don't do the same things you do, like nobody. I'll pay for expensive, you know what I like I've done that, but What's the point of doing that if you're still not in mm -hmm. the problem? Right. Like you see, you're not helping to promote health Right. And you do have to, I mean, cleaning the toenails is part of a pedicure. Pedicures aren't just polishing the toenails. And that's all they 
Yeah, this is definitely going to be a double soaker because this is real hard right here. I gotta let this and that, soak that, and that, that does hurt. Once it's exposed, yeah. now it can get some more cuticle remover and some water. So soak that and up. They weren't doing anything with that. Yeah, I'm sure. All right, we'll straighten that all the way out. I'm short. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can probably scoot that chair up some. But I did start doing what you said about rubbing the towel. Mm -hmm. I, I and that helps a lot. That, that, yeah. And I have one in the shower that I hit, you know, but sometimes I just. I was tired. I don't even feel <laughs> I know. it. It's so bad. Or you just forget. Yeah. It's You're in a hurry. Yeah. You're like, I'll do it tomorrow. <clears throat> and I had noticed my toenail even starting to turn. My big one back. I could tell. I was like, oh, I need to hurry up quick and get them away. So what's on your Christmas list? Mm, I kind of don't even want to do Christmas. Oh. I don't. <laughs> it's those long shifts, they're wearing you out. It, yeah. But I already got my, my mom's gift arrived. Yesterday when I got here, she had been wanting one of those Michelle Obama purses and I ordered her one. Okay. But she's in Florida. She lives outside. I was there for that. She oh. lived, yes. Scary. Yes, but that wasn't my first hurricane, but I was there for that, and so she's there, so I got it shipped to me, and I'm going to... Are you going to go down it. and see her? No, I, gotta ship I have it. to work. My yeah. shift is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and so I pretty much have to work. I had to work Thanksgiving, and I have to work Christmas. I'm going to get to my little guy stuff. Could you imagine how much snow we would have had today if all this rain would have, it would have been cold enough? Oh, it would have been bad. Really bad. And it's raining in Dayton too. I'm like, it's Okay, rain. you can put that foot back in the water. It's gonna rain my whole month. Plus I have to move, so I'm, I'm trying not to do too much for Christmas. I do. Like six months ago, well, no, nine months ago, I came off the road. Do you like it better? I like the money then. Oh, you, you know, yeah. had better. Nothing compares to that. Judy? To that. That's scary. scary. Being a, you know. Driving, they and this truck stopping, so oh. you are vulnerable, right? Because you're climbing up in the truck, and then it's not like you just get in and close the door, like you still have to get situated, you know, and close the door. It's easy for someone to force their way when you're getting in the truck, and they found her. And not and it, 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 it did freak me out because that's a place I stop that often, yeah, it's scary. Worried, about you. I'm 
She ain't one of those 83. Well, she's still worrying about you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah she was. I did it for like four years. And it's like, you had it time. Worrying. <laughs> Mothers never stop worrying. Never, never. Oh my God, I'm 45, mother. That doesn't matter. Nope. I'm going to be 65. I'm going to lie. This is going You know, there's still people homeless down in there in Panama City. Like, when I say it destroyed 90% of Panama City. Really? Yeah. The beach was virtually untouched. But it's really sad. Man, we've been back up <laughs> Yeah, it's really pushing on the end of that toe. Well, I saved it all for you, Lori. <laughs> Thank you. And the world thanks you, too. <laughs> Even though you're probably, you're probably like, oh, Jesus, it's going to be one of those Mondays. Oh, no, I love this. I mean, the bigger before and after that it makes. holding things at the right angle or they're you know people ask me all the time why I don't use fingernail clippers and it's because fingernail clippers are shaped in a u-shape this way toenails are shaped this way so how are you going to fit something that's got an opening that's flat onto a toenail that's curved the opposite way right. and that's all that they use yeah and when I did persuade like the one work. chick not to, because I tried to show her your video, she almost killed me oh. with the nippers. And I was just like, stop. Just, yeah. Just, you, 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 I, I should not have showed you. <laughs> I should not have asked you to do that, because you don't know. She needs to take one of my online training and courses. that's what I told her. <laughs> I'm like, if you take one, if, if you look at Lori long enough, um, I might come back to you. Why don't you go up there and shadow her? She's not that far away. You should, you should have people shave I bet you they do. Oh, people have. It's just, you, you know, I have to pay attention to my clients. <laughs> That's true. That's true. And I, I'm booked back to back to back to back. So it's. I'm it's, you know, I barely, I, you know, sometimes I might only go to the bathroom once or not, you know, I don't usually eat during the day, and it's. And that bathroom thing is no joke, like, that is, that's not good. Yeah. That's why I keep trying to drink a lot of water during the day to make me have to. Go to the bathroom. Yeah. Because I don't want to get a kidney infection or anything. I didn't get older and can't hold it at all. <laughs> like I said, I have to go now, like right now. The pressure. <laughs> 
Have to work tonight? No, in the morning. Okay. Nine. Actually, I'm working the rest of this week. <laughs> but then people still want you but like no I want the real Lori mm -hmm. cause that's how I would probably be I would you know I don't know <laughs> after the cuticle remover does its job you can always tell where the skin is that needs to be removed because it has turned white just be gentle don't dig and just slowly remove everything from around the toenails how many left-handed people do I have watching me today? Sound off in the comments. If you haven't seen my announcement, I now have a left-handed cuticle pusher just for you. So check it out on my online store. I also have a left-handed pedicure kit. And you have to watch it big, like that's so weird. But I like Dr. Pimple Popper too. Mm -hmm. so I want to ask you guys a really yeah, big favor awesome. today. I would really appreciate it um, if you would click the Instagram, share button the and share screen. on your social media like sites to help more people find my channel. Thank you so much in and advance. This other one. And this, I know it's kind of weird, but sometimes you can't tell. And she works on getting the knees for me to reach. What? With ingrown hairs and stuff. Really? That's a big, like, that's a major business. I didn't know that. Wow. I, I, I know, I'm so weird. <laughs> but you can't really tell what it is. Oh. You know, and, right. and less sometimes this camera slips and you're like, oh, wow. Oh, okay. That's what you were working on. But she does like underarms and stuff too, because you know, people's off pores get clogged and yep. you know. You know like, so we're about halfway through the video right now. I hope you're still watching and I can't wait for you to see the before and after pictures coming up at the end of the video. I'd like to point out an ergonomic preventative move that you need to do when you're filing someone's feet. You'll see me put my hand under someone's heel when I'm filing, but my forearm is always resting on my leg. You don't want to hold up the foot with your arm because you'll put too much strain on your arm it will go up your back and into your neck and it'll become very uncomfortable by the end of the day so protect yourself now did they use the acid to burn the root of the nail or did it grow back i think it kind of grew i don't remember acid it was a long time ago but okay. i think he had some big old tool and he shot my foot my toe and then you have to spray, spray the freezing spray on it. Dude, the needle, I swear the needle was that long. It probably was only this big. Right. But going in your foot and you seeing it, mm -hmm. it's not like they knock you out, you right. know. Right. Uh, not for something like that. But who wants to see that big old needle going into your toe? Ugh. But yeah, like they, in the big old... It looked like the nipper, but it, I swear it was huge. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. 
but when he pulled it out, it had started growing. It was, it literally was curved into my toe. Yeah. So, but I couldn't hardly walk after that. I had to have shots in this finger. Mm. Um, I have psoriatic arthritis. And for a whole year, I couldn't bend this finger at all. Mm. It swelled up about that big around Ooh. and was purple. And I had to take a test that I needed to bend my fingers. And I had about, it was about two months away, I think. And I went to see my rheumatologist and I said, you have to do something about this. And he was like, I don't think you're ever going to be able to bend that finger again. And I was said, oh, I'm going to bend this right. finger. I have to use this finger. Yeah. <laughs> and he was like, well, I can put cortisone shots in it. And I said, all right, let's do it. So he put shots down in here, mm. in each of the joints. And then I just, I just wrenched on it every single day. I bent it as hard as I could back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. Mm. And it, I'm, I can bend it now. I have scar tissue and stuff in it, but it moves. But when I was at the office and he was putting that needle in my hand, that was weird because when your foot, you're pretty far away from it. Yeah. Your eyeballs and it's your hand is yeah. like right there. It's like, yep. oh my god, I'm about to pass out. Mm -hmm. Be such a big baby. Like I was good and grown, and my man, I made my mama come with me. Like I need. <laughs> Yeah. Then she was mommy. I need mommy. Mommy. He had had to do them to the joints and my toes before, so I kind of knew what to expect. But okay, you can put that put back in the water. There's always more skin to remove when the foot comes out of the water for the second time. And so I'm going to work and very I diligently to remove you. all of the skin that has turned white oh, yeah. around her toenails. I know you don't like to hurt, but sometimes pain comes, <laughs> pain comes with it. <laughs> no, I don't need to. I think other people make you have that here because they can't do the job without killing you.
seven hour drive, no problem. Three hour drive, really no problem. Well, right, that's a blink of an eye. I'm yeah. gonna get into the groove. It almost made me this. Driving. Don't say that too loud, your mama might hear. <laughs> she doesn't watch. Stress in your feet. I do. Yeah, I know. I do. I think I was overcompensating for my foot. Like, when I say that I've been like limping for real, mm -hmm. yeah, I, I have been. I felt that. the difference between applying lotion to a leg and giving a leg massage. It's almost like asking a man for massage, you know. <laughs> saying, like, when is a man really just giving you a for real massage? Unless you're paying them. Polish today, or are you gonna go naked? No, I'm not. You know, it's wintertime. Okay, you can bend that knee. 
How's this feel? It's not hurting. I can feel like when you was pulling that out, that felt great. <laughs> I want you to bleed. <laughs> you like you are not being a bad influence. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't saying that though sometimes when I'm watching you, I'm like, pull it! Pull it up! <laughs> You're not bleeding on my watch. I'm not putting on gloves today. <laughs> You like you ain't coming with all that. <laughs> you will come back. <laughs> there will be no body fluids. <laughs> I understand that. So what do you suggest? And that's four weeks, six weeks? You can do six weeks. Six. Because I know it's not a one, you know, you're not going to have all of the craziness mm -mm. rectified in one day. Well, I know I was in my studies when I had that done. Yeah. Well, this is colored acrylic. Mm, I learned. Yeah. I don't even have on this. I don't even have any top coat on these. This one has top coat on. You can see it's shiny. Mm -hmm. uh, it's time for me to get a fill. Like I've been stalking you on the last, I, I know I've left comments, like on the last, like, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, I
Oh, shit, I cracked toes. I'm like, crack my toes. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> what are you thinking? Don't be asking me to crack your toes, Ryder. <laughs> uh, we need one of those chiropractors shows. I watch crack some of those, too. Uh, yeah. I love to watch the smell. Just hear the cracks and pops. I'm like, I want to go do that. See, I started watching them because of my body issues. I'm like, I need somebody to fix me. Mm -hmm. Yes, because what you, I could, just your posture when you're having to do this, I'm sure you, mm -hmm. you could probably write that off as a, uh, an expense mm -hmm. for your business. Mm -hmm. Girl, you probably can't cut that up. You probably don't have time. You probably on the go, on running. I know. I know you're busy, <laughs> <clears throat> This one has little baby ones in it, but not any big ones. That one, I could. If I could hear it, I could. In my mind, it was like pop, 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 pop. Mm -hmm. it was probably because I was limping on like this. That one was hurting the most. Yeah. a lot of compacted skin. So oh, I need the Ingram. Now as as uh, the dents will start to come back up mm -hmm. and go back around the nail where they're supposed to be instead of being pressed so far down into your skin. So that time you're here, if you come on a Monday, you can schedule a massage with Janelle. Shut up. I did not know. Uh, I got excited. Mm -hmm. you, <laughs> I did not know that. Yeah. We got uh, massage therapists on, well, every day, but... your mom making y'all worried <laughs> you know i mean but things happen like that 
I'm so happy winter is over and the sun is finally out on a regular basis. I'd love to hear if you guys have any vacation plans. Hope you're doing something fun this year. Tell me what you were doing in the comment section. I really appreciate everyone being here. I'm not sure when this video is going to post, so if my April 25th through the 27th classes have already passed, my next classes are going to be in Gatlinburg, Tennessee this year on July 11th at the Nail Tech event of the Smokies. You can look up that information on that Facebook page for the Nail Tech event of the Smokies and on my website to find my meticulous manicurist courses. for taking time out of your day to visit my channel. People like you are the reason for my success and I appreciate it so much. But remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for all the latest videos. Remember it is free and I'll see you next time.